What's up guys, and welcome to another episode of Let's Play Ratchet & Clank Future Quest for Booty. And we're not going this way, are we? No, we're not. We want to go this way. What will we find over here? Oh my god, we're gonna find him. Do not shoot at me, please. Oop, he's gonna shoot at me. Don't shoot at me. Don't do it. It's not cool. Get out of here. Get away from me. Oh, jeez. Okay, he's gone. He's gone. He's gone. Let's grab this one. Oh, no, there's another one. Uh, or that might be the same one. I mean, these guys probably could be a few of them. But I have no idea. Just gotta get away from them. Oh, no. no we seem to be safe for now. Till we blow the whole place up into smithereens and, you know, we go on with it. Well, we all get to be fine. I knew I was gonna do that. It was funny, it was worth it. Worth the laugh. I have to pick up all these bolts, and before we go over there, we're gonna have to pick up one of these little guys, or the uh, bats will start attacking us. Yep, there they are, they're gonna be scared right away. Now we're gonna be really, really slow here, or we will walk right off the edge. It is a pain in the butt, so I don't suggest it. Gotta carefully scoot along here. Oh jeez, and everything starts rattling and shaking. No! Carefully. Oh, there's more. Yeah, I'm gonna do anything. Just hop on here right quickly. Yeah, okay. Okay, cool. Now we're going along here. We should be pretty much safe from falling off if we play this right. Ooh, we're going into the ship. What's gonna be in here? Not much. We're already out of the ship. Yep, was that the ship? It looks like there's another one, but there's another one of these guys! No, don't hit me! It's not advised. I'm a nice guy, really. We can talk about this. We can talk! Apparently not. Um, let's throw this over here. We didn't even need it to be there. We have another source over here, but I like hanging on to the little guys. As long as possible, at least. Keep on throwing some of our explosives, r explosives around. And blow this up, too. Okay, cool. I think we could go over here. Well, there's not anything over there, so we can't go over there. Uh, we just gotta wind this up then. Alright, is there anything behind us? Ah, uh, not the looks of it. Okay, what is so interesting that's on this ship? Uh, we have the crazy, now two of them, no, 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 don't hurt me. Okay, okay, that one left, and so did that one, cool. Alright, let's fling over here before they show back up like they were. Oh, and this is the ship we need to be on. Okay then, let's unwind this so that they can come over here. Now, just extend the flight and we'll meet you aboard! The fairest battle in pirating history. Right. Don't you stand right there, mate? I'll check for booby traps. Booby traps? Isn't that a bit cliche? <laughs> Not at all, mate. After all, you're the boob, and here's the trap. I'll forever find me so to me. Cheers for the help, mate. Couldn't have gotten through the cabins without you.
Oh, Rusty Pete, that little cheater. Okay, we're going to have to, one thing, make our way out of this cavern, this cave area. Not gonna be that easy. There's gonna be a lot of ghosts, aren't there? Yep, I was getting a ghosty vibe, and here they come. Let's kill them up, though. I hate these guys. Now I'm angry. I need to kill some things in frustration, or get hit by a pirate. Either or. But I think this will unveil all of Darkwater's evil minions now, which is not a good thing. Let's throw one of these. Kaboom. There you go. More are coming, though. We gotta get ready. Let's not run out of bullets completely. But I could probably hit this guy a few times before I need to... Oh, no. He got me. Darn it. Let's keep on shooting. The lot are showing up. <laughs> this is starting to, get, it's starting to get overwhelming. Okay, well, sorry about that. I got a little bit of an interruption. Unavoidable sometimes. Alright, I'm getting hit really bad. So let me stop screwing around, throw some fusion bombs at these jerks, and hopefully that'll be it. When it comes to some spawning, no, there still has to be, of course, one more. There you go, that should be it now. Hopefully. Um, I don't want to deal with any more. Most, mostly, that's what I don't. Oh, oh, really? <laughs> I really just messed that up. Okay, so when I was fighting, I did upgrade again my little shooter, and now it shoots three. I think no. Yeah, three, three shots. Now that's awesome. Pretty cool. Now we can hop up here though and make our way out of here. I think. Let's see. Will we run into any more nasties on our way? Probably. Oh, there's one right there. Excuse me, sir. Get the heck out of here. I mean, we're ha I'm happy we got one of some of our guns back. Not all of them, but just two. What's happening? There's green smoke everywhere and... <gasps> pirates! Yes, pirates. So surprising. Okay. Um, now we have a bunch of them to kill, though. Here's a bunch of them. Uh, let's get them out of here. Okay, cool. Now I do remember... No, it's not over there. Can this give me any health or do I have full? I have full. And we, I'm looking around for a room where I can blow stuff up and so that I can get some nice, nice secrets. Because I know there are a handful of secrets in the area, I believe. But before I do, I got some people to fight. So I got some pirates over here. Yes, I do. I think it's in this room where there's... I don't know. I generally just... It's out of my memory. Yeah, it's definitely not over there. So we got to make a way up. Up it is, on the gigantic evil elevator of evilness. Of course, the most evil thing in this whole area, the elevator. No doubt about it. Mm-hmm. Oh, we got another nasty. This time we can take him on with some weapon warfare. Oh, and there you go. He gave up easy. Okay. Not as scary when that kind of stuff happens. All right, so we do have to blow our way through here now. Not that big of a deal. And now we can hop down here. Uh, which way am I going now? Oh, there are zo then zombies. These guys are not zombies, they are zombie pirates. Obviously a huge difference. Actually, if you really think about it, they're zombie robot pirates. Huh. What a big title that is. A little overambitious, if you ask me. Think I'm going this way? Yeah, I think this is the way I'm supposed to go. And more zombie robot pirates. Oh, no, he's going way over there. Let me bomb this up. Why is it not letting me? There you go. Kablam. Where is she? Not in here. Where'd she go? I don't know where she went, but I'm going to throw stuff at this guy. Excuse me. Pardon me. No, no, you're not... Thanks, Ratchet. I knew you'd keep your promise. Come on! We gotta get back to the island before Slag does! Alright, let's get out of here and save the island. Don't want them to ruin that, but before we do... Before we hurry, let's take our time lingering on for secrets. We're going in here and picking up this! It is a, um... Py pyrocytic precipitation... thing. These are installed to your things, and it's like you can find these throughout the game and they'll help you with your weapon. They'll make them a little bit better, from my knowledge, that's all they do. Sort of like gold bolts, but not. Alright, let's kill some more things on our way out here. And we should be good.
So, in his effort to claim the Fulcrum Star, our hero was outwitted by the charming Rusty Pete, <laughs> a loyal pirate whose only desire was to bring back his beloved Captain Slag. Scourge of Polaris and winner of Zordoom Prison's semi-annual beauty pageant. Of course, there were a few side effects. Hundreds of undead pirates were now free to roam the planet. And the captain now had to share a body with the pirate he killed long ago. But all in all, it was a great day. <laughs> Okay, and we're back on Hulafar Island. Can make our way over here if we want. It's them! They're attacking us! The undead crew of Angstrom Darkwater. Here, take these. They washed ashore this afternoon. Ooh. Ah! Head for the Obsidian Eye! Limbs be undead pirates! Run for your lives! It's the curse of Darkwater! The rumors are true! Save yourselves! Okay. Alright, so we are now defending against these guys who are attacking the shore. Might as well just shoot these guys up and get rid of them as fast as possible. We now do have the tornado launcher and the rock rav the shock ravager. Do I use a shock ravager a bit, but the tornado launcher has never been my weapon of choice. Um, I just think it's sort of funky and it doesn't work that right, that well. Oh jeez. Let's see. There we go. Okay, so there are a lot of pirates that come in here. They are trying to storm the island. And our job is to obviously stop them. Stop the evil pirate mutant zombie robots. Shouldn't be that hard though. There are some enemies that show up here in a little bit that are a little more difficult to deal with. They like shoot their heads out at us, and it's sort of annoying. But this can be a little lengthy. There are a ton of robots that, that actually show up, and now we're getting shot at from the ship itself too, which is also annoying. There's just a ton of stuff that starts attacking, really. Okay, so let's just keep on shooting here and get rid of as many as we can. Hopefully we don't die, because if you die, I think you gotta do it all over, and it's really a pain. Okay, so how have you guys' days been going? I mean, it's been a little while. How's it been? Well, now we know what the BS stands for. Ooh. Ratchet said a bad word, um, not directly, but intentionally. But now he's going to be shooting stuff at us, and you gotta see these little weird faces. You gotta shoot at them when he shoots those at us, but we also have to shoot at the rockets when they open, so just get rid of them when you can. He's gonna shoot another one out here. First, let me shoot at this, then get rid of the face. And this is a rinse and repeat. Shoot at this, get rid of the face. You can only shoot at the, you know, the uh, turrets though when they are open, like this one is right now. And now shoot this face. It looks like a face to me, at least. I mean, maybe I'm wrong, but that's what it looks like. Okay, now shoot this one and gone. Okay, that one's gone. Nice. Got to keep on doing it though. And then they, um, I think after we get this one, it'll turn around. There's another one down. This can be a sort of annoying, and it's actually easy to die here if you don't manage these little dang faces coming to attack you. I mean, Angstrom Darkwater, evil pirate of the sea, sends evil dead faces to attack you. Everybody run at the ugly face. There we go, get rid of them all. Oh no, it's still chasing me though. No, don't chase me. Okay. I've been while that happened, it looks like they attacked. They started attacking the door. Not a problem, really. I mean, just come over here and start shooting them up. One thing I never understand about zombies and, like, the dead being reanimated like it is here. You can reanimate the dead once, why not again? I mean, is there, like, a reasoning to that or something that I'm not understanding? Is there a zombie lore that was explained sometime and I wasn't paying attention or maybe I was just not alive at that time? 
But it's like, I don't know, the dead gets reanimated in like every video game, but then they just don't come back after you kill them. Like, what's stopping them? All right, this guy can be a pain. You want to just aim at his turrets? But, uh, you don't have to. I know we got more people coming on over here, and you can see that guy in the back with the green coming out of him. He shoots his heads at you, and they're hard to kill because they're so small, but I killed him off before it became a problem. Looks like we have more coming out of the sea, though. Let's get rid of these guys. This guy has a shield. Easiest way to get rid of this guy is throw a grenade at him, and then it will make it easier to manage. And you can see one of the heads right there. It's a pain in the butt, I tell you. Now let's get rid of this guy. Bye-bye. That's just one Lombax, the only Lombax. Okay then, let's just shoot this guy again. We saw one of these a little earlier. Not that big of a deal, we can kill it again. Kill it before we can kill it again. So as you can see though, my playing style has improved since the last LP. I mean, is it the best? Of course not. Is it the worst? Of course not. But a lot of people complain in Tools of Destruction. I'm not going to even, like, lie. So many people complained about my playstyle last LP, so you know I thought it would be a good haha -ha to uh, you know prove them wrong that I'm not a stinky player. Oh jeez, watch out! Oh, there you go. And there's the turret again. Okay, let's run over there and get rid of it. Get rid of all the stuff. Get a few good shots off on this before it closes. There you go, and now he starts shooting the face. He shoots two this time, which was what it makes it so much harder to manage. And you just sort of have to play it so that um, you don't even shoot at the faces until the absolute last second, pretty much. Alright, get rid of this one. Start shooting at the next thing that opens, which will be this. Shoot this face, and shoot that face. Got the turret down. Now shoot more faces. Union regulations. More union regulations, darn union. Okay, let's get rid of this one. We could take a face shot to one of these things, but I'm not sure how good that'll be for us. I'm trying to get rid of this last turret as fast as possible. Get rid of this face, get away. There you go. Okay, so the last one, so it shouldn't be that hard. There it goes. Alright, now run away. You saved us all, stranger. We have to catch up with Darkwater before he comes back for another raid. Do you have any idea where he went? The Morrow Caverns? But the Fulcrum Star isn't in Morrow Caverns. We would have found it. Isn't there any place else they'd go? Fed this map, maybe it's a clue. A map? Ratchet, that could be the location of Darkwater's treasure. See if you can find someone to translate it. Thanks again, kid. Okay, it looks like we gotta find somebody to translate it, but we'll ca take care of that in the next episode of Let's Play. Ratchet and Clank Future Quest for Booty. I always forget the name as soon as I try to pronounce it, but thank you guys for watching, and as always, I'll see you guys later.